manufacturers use things like decals to pretty up their product. Unfortunately these sorts of things don't last too well in Australia's weather and soon they're crazed or cracked or looking very unsightly. Hopefully this video will give you some ideas on how to remove the vinyl and patch up any other little blemishes. We're using a 2000 watt hot air gun but you could use a hair dryer of similar power. But in order to get under the edge of it you need to pick it up with something and I'm using a stick that I've sanded nice and sharp on the edge, just any old piece of wood. And uh, that'll help to sort of get up under the edge of it. Once you've got a visible edge that you can pull on, then it's easy going. Again, if it's too hot for you to touch, well then it's too hot for the job. When it's getting a little too supple, take the heat away, just reapply it sparingly. Rod little bits, you could try using some of the sticky vinyl, rub it over and peel it up. Just press it down and rub it over, heat it a bit, peel it up and you may get those last little bits off. Okay, we mentioned before how to get rid of the residue that melts off from some areas of the um, process. So if you get yourself some metho, put it on a clean rag and just put it on the area that you need to clean and then just give it a gentle rub and it comes off. Okay, so that's bringing that off beautifully. So there we go, Metho is bringing that off nicely. We've just got the last of it. It's probably good to just dob it on a little bit for starters and then it soaks in and then you can just rub it away. Hey, voila, there it is. All done. So now we come to the point of trying to restore the lustre from the old and where the protected uh, surface is. You know, we've taken the vinyl away now, but this has been exposed for years and it needs rejuvenation to match the other side. So I'm just going to use a basic product here liquid cut and polish. I think any polish would do the trick. But um, as always, put a little bit on the, the rag. Get a clean rag. So you can the surface of cutting away a bit. Make a little pad up out of it. And, uh, you can check every now and then with the fresh part of the rag and see how you're going with that. So that's starting to come up rather nicely. But this area is like new and this area is aged, but I'm going to be quite happy with that certainly look a bit a lot better than what they all was like. Well that's it. Thank you for watching. I hope that's been of some help to you. Keep your RV looking good and you'll keep the resale high.